Beaver made walking stick. I think it's gonna snow. Me and my family really enjoy making videos and sharing them with you. This time I'm going to be showing some behind the scene footage at the beaver dam. I rigged up the underwater camera to a long pole to try and get some interesting shots. The problem is the equipment wouldn't cooperate very well. Yeah, I think. Does it, is it counting down? Beavers are really good at making meadows and things like that. They back the water up so that it floods certain areas so that they can get to their food, get to willows and aspen, cottonwood and things like that so that they can store it up and eat it in the winter time. And they've got a dam built right down there and it's flooded back over this way clear around this corner sometimes they make a big pile of sticks for their winter home and dig into it and make their winter home that way but when they have a, a mud bank like that over there I think in that case they just dig in under the bank and hollow it out store all their stuff in there for the winter I think that may be where they have dug in the bank to make their winter home back in there. I'm not sure. You can see where they've been chewing on willow sticks. That's a pretty fresh one. Here's an old piece that they've gnawed on. It's not a very good idea to be packing a metal pole and a camera in a thunderstorm. As the storm got closer, I started getting more nervous. Crick's all dammed up and looks to me like the beavers have been coming up here and they may be living in this hole. It looks like it's been abandoned for a while, but surely they lived here sometime or another. I'll have to see if I can find where they're living now. My little 360 camera is pretty handy for getting into places that I can't fit into. Beavers were the... <laughs> Oops. There now.
beavers have been making walking sticks a lot longer than I have. Look at that. It's been chewed by a beaver. You can see little gnaw marks all along the edge of it where he's taking the bark off. Here's the other end where he's chewed it in half. And you know what? That's just the perfect length for a walking stick. This might end up being my favorite new walking stick. A beaver made walking stick. I think it's going to steal. I thought I'd try one more time to get some underwater shots. Pearl wasn't too sure it was going to work. Yeah. Some pretty plants here. 
the whole area smells like mint. There's wild mint growing all over. I wish you could smell it because it smells really good here. You start getting the smells of the fall too. All these leaves are starting to turn color. It's just after a rain so it smells really fresh out here. I bet that'd make a good tea. It's mildly minty. Tastes really good. Add a little bit of honey in there, it tastes better. When we're all done filming, we head back to the studio where my daughter and I piece it all together. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.